The rundown on your feature event, 25 laps. On the pole is car number 98, Bud Finale of Jamestown, New York, a 1957 Chevy. Next off the pole, car number 27L, Sammy Lyman Crusoe of Jamestown, New York, a 1957. Can you get the Lyman Crusoe? That's what we needed, the real muscle. <laughs> Here's the picture. Here's me. Two, two Cusamanos with the whole thing like Cusamano. That is terrific. <laughs> okay, I love it. This is just like days of old, huh? Oh yeah. Doing a lot of a lot of trimming, but <laughs> they'll get it. Them two guys will make it fit. So those are the tin guys. You know, this is, have they always been that? I mean, is that their oh, John and their Bucky's ex expertise? Yeah, they're, they're both body men. Yeah. You know, they started out as body men at the, at the, with, their, with their fathers, yeah. you know, at the Cosimano Brothers Garage. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and they still do that, you know. Now, Bucky, now, he's retired, but Johnny runs this shop here, this car star store here. Well, you know the story. Cusimano Brothers. Who were the Cusimano Brothers? Well, it was Bucky's brother who was Jim. Mm -hmm. um, then John's father was John. Mm -hmm. And as a Russell that has superior automotive, right. his dad was was Pete. Okay. Okay. Then as a, one other brother, his name was Sam. Now his son is, owns um, Teleset. Mm -hmm. And uh, those them four boys. Uh, now three of them were in the service, and Pete was running the place on Water Street. And that's when I got hooked up with him, just as a kid, mm -hmm. in the in the forties during the Second World War. Then, when all the boys came back, they built a new place on Water Street, and that was in forty. Well, when the war in forty four or forty three, whatever. It was. We're about on Water Street. Right on the bend, right there. You know where the fire department is on the corner yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's behind that. It's right on the bend there. Okay. Uh, yeah. They were there for years. And then in 49, they start building the place up on Buffalo Street. Mm -hmm. Now these kids, well some of them weren't even born then when I was down there. Well I don't think any of them were. Well Bucky was around. I remember seeing Bucky when he was a little kid on a tricycle down there at the garage while his dad was in the service. Um, but then they, in 49 they built the, the place up on Buffalo Street. And then from there, then Jerry bought it in, what, 83. Mm -hmm. so, but the Cusimanos were well known and, um, and good. They had a very good reputation. Did they always have Dodge? Uh, no. No, at one point they were like a um, satellite dealer for Kaiser, Kaiser mm -hmm. Fraser. And then we got um, Packard in, in 50, uh, 53, I believe it was. Then we got Etzel, and that was around until they took it from him when they merged with the Mercury store. Then we got Dodge in 59. And they had it up right through the sale? They had it up until 83. Yeah. Yeah. And I'd been with them all the way. Yeah. And I'm st still around there a little bit. So, yeah. well, <laughs> but it's now Jerry Swanson's Dodge garage. But. Were you sold on Dodges? I mean, as you, uh, you well, I guess, yeah, because <laughs> you know, I used to run, you know, different. I used to run Fords and st stuff, right. um, but you know, I try to be brand loyal. So, and while they had the Packard agencies, when I start building them two Studebakers, right, because Studebaker merged with Packard, so to be brand loyal to my employer, we ran a couple of Studebakers. We're too good though. <laughs> but then when they got the Dodge agency, then I start putting Dodges together. So. But it's been fun. Um, you know, at least um, you know I tried a lot of different things, different cars and stuff. If I just stuck with one thing, I'd probably have been better off. But I had fun. Well, here we yeah. are. Yeah, and here we are. You're right. Seventy-one, soon to be out. Once these tin guys get their act together, is that what you said, Sam? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's slowing down on us. They're a little older now, you know. <laughs> We're about 90. <laughs>